Hey people, what's going on? Today I'm checking out the uh, Legendary Tones Hot Mod module. Not this one, not the Hot Mod V2, but actually the scary, Mr. Scary one. It's got cool graphics. It's Mine is white and it's got the skeleton uh, graphic printed on top. And it sounds a little bit different. Um, I did a video on that module, the Mr. Scary George Lynch module, um, using my Marshall already. But um, the thing is, David Saba does was uh, such a nice guy. He sent me that module for free and asked me just to do a couple of posts and videos. So here I go. And he gave me a special little um, socket adapter so I can actually use my Vox AC30 right here and the reason why I got it turned around like this is actually because um, like I'm, I'm gonna film this and put it in the video um, you have to turn your app like that because on a Vox AC30 head like this one um, yeah, it's Im impossible to put that module in <laughs> without it turning it like that. Anyway, um, this is what it sounds like. I, I got a little bit of um, got a little bit of something going on right here. The reverb. Oh, uh, let me just turn that off. I mean, as you can tell, it's just a bunch of fun to play that thing. Um, probably, if you click this video, you know what this, what these kind of modules are about. They basically, um, I think the idea is that back in the days, in the 70s and 80s, you had these marshals, and they just did not have enough gain. So people like Friedman and uh, what's that other famous guy called, Jose something, they started modding marshals for uh, guys like uh, uh, Paul Stanley or Van Halen. Steve Vay had one that was modded. And um, it basically gave those marshals more gain. And you could also play them at lower volumes, which is cool. Because, <laughs> um, yeah, they're way too loud for most situations. So, um, of course, you could use a pedal, but the other thing is just to mod your amp. Well, it's pretty. Uh, it's a pretty big effort to get your Marshall modded, right? So yeah, this is the solution. You just stick this in the in your amp, and now you actually have the possibility to not just put it into Marshalls, but you can actually put them into all kinds of different amps, and it's not just about the gain. It's also, um, you know, it changes the way your amp feels. And it feels different playing through this kind of module than, um, you know, compared to putting um, a boost pedal or a distortion pedal in front of your amp. Because you can basically imagine it, I imagine it like this, that the distortion that's coming from a pedal is... Um, you know, you, you're going from your guitar into that pedal, that's where the distortion is happening, and then you're going with that distortion into the front end of your amp. Well, with this thing right here, it's different. It's a little bit different, because you put this in the second um, preamp, you, you replace the second uh, preamp tube. So, I mean, I can't explain technically <laughs> why it's such a big difference, but it, it feels different. Like. 
I can only say it as a musician, what I can hear and um, how the amp responds. And this turns the Vox AC30, which is not a high gain amp, into a high gain amp. <laughs> You don't need a pedal anymore, anything. Um, that's a cool thing. You just grab your amp, put it in there, and you're good to go. Um, so, yeah, I guess um, I'm using going straight from the guitar into the amp. Just put the Mr. Scary mod into the um, replace the second preamp tube. Uh, I'm going into the aux box so I can actually dial in the master volume and dial in everything the way I like it. And I'm going into the second channel, which basically has a little bit more gain to start off with. But as I said, and you got, you probably know this, a Vox AC30 is not a high gain amp. You always need something um, to boost it, you know, to give it some more distortion, some more sustain. But now it has this incredibly awesome sound. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's another thing. Like, um... So you hear that? I mean, I got a lot of gain going on. And d depending on where I turn. Like, but there's all, almost no noise. That's another advantage whoops, of, oh, holy shit, of these things. Uh, compared to a pedal, like there's only few pedals that um, do not have that much of a noise level. I'm thinking of like, shit. <laughs> I'm thinking of like a full tone. Um, what's it called? The OD, but full tone. That's a pretty good pedal. Does not have that much noise, but most pedals do. And um, my advice, if you want to have more gain, yeah check this out. I'm really enjoying this. So it's just a little video to give you an update on what's happening here. Um, pretty cool. Thanks to David Sabados for sending me this stuff and uh, yeah, see you next time.